Could you have a real job? Are you sure, though? Oh, Connor! This is so funny. It's not, com- it's not coming off. A seashell? A, a seashell? seashell? By the seashore? Mom, we can all agree with that one. That was a weird choice. Okay, look, mom's really hard work. It is. It's really hard to be a mom, you know what I mean? And it's like, look, I'm telling you right now, uh, as a peripheral mom, right? <laughs> you know, as, you know, as a as wife. A peripheral hand, mom. You know what I mean? That you know what I mean? should be a category. You know what I mean? When, when the wife mom. is handling business, and I'm getting tired just thinking about how hard that is to manage these little fellas. Yeah. Uh, but it's it's just the truth. Like you, as a mom. You basically have a certain amount of energy that you can give throughout the day, and it slowly gets pulled away depending on how chaotic your little children are. You Mm -hmm. know what I mean? Uh, How much respect do you have for for what your mother went through to raise you? Tremendous. A lot, especially because my mom did it all on her own. That's what I'm saying. Imagine how many times your mom was just on E. Just, I mean, yeah. nothing to give, and you were in there like, yeah, West Coast oh, in the house. I feel like that's why my mom, like, my mom loves me. I know my mom loves me, but like, <laughs> I mean, like, uh, I know like, 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 my mom loves me. I'm, I'm, not, I'm pretty I sure. I know I annoy the <laughs> out of her, though. Like, yeah. we're just not the same person. We're so different. Like, I love hip hop, she loves rock. It's like everything about us is like the opposite. Yeah. And, um, I think that me as a kid, I had so much energy that like, just... like I, I think that one of the things she would do is pretend to be asleep. Yeah, okay. <laughs> and I'd be like, she's already asleep. Cause I knew if she was asleep, I had to be quiet and be good. So I think she would just pretend to be asleep. Mm. So Four that... o'clock. Yeah. <laughs> so that I would, no, like... it's like two, thir- oh. So that I would calm down. Yeah, look, she tricked you. <laughs> she tricked you. She just kept looking out the eye until you calmed down and then she got up. <laughs> Uh, well, look, every mother in this category of barely hanging on as well. Take a look at Mommy on Empty. Mom, I made you an egg. The girls at church will love it. <laughs> hey, Katie. Hey. Mama, Mama wig ain't glued on that, that much so it's gonna fall off. <laughs> Man, she got, she got so serious. Good <laughs> <laughs> kids, me old bro. She heard this wife said before. Mama wig ain't glued on that, that much, so it's gonna fall off. That yeah, much gonna fall off. You can't go no damn well. well okay. <laughs> well, last time I take you out. <laughs> oh man. Mom looks so happy to throw it out. She is happy to throw it out. (laughs) There you have it for Mommy on Empty. Okay, um, I know in my household, uh, the mom is the the tough one on the kids, okay? Uh, I'm a softy. You know what I mean? I get tricked into just about anything. You know what I mean? And my daughter, she knows how to trick me. Her latest thing is, I'm cold, Dada, can you hold me? And, And they were trying to explain to me that she only says it to me and I'm like, that's not true. And then they did an experiment where I stayed out of the room. She was totally fine the moment I walked in the room. Dad, I'm cold. <laughs> Dad, I'm cold. That's cute. Oh, man, got me. Uh, where the wife will be like, you are not cold. Get back in your chair. Fine. <laughs> and she's not cold anymore. You know what I mean? That's funny. <laughs> you think your mother's uh, laid down the law with you guys? My mom, well, I realized why my parents were not meant to be together because they're strict about like the opposite things and nice about the opposite things. Like my dad like would clean up after me. My mom's like, clean your room. <laughs> One strict about, the other's not. If they were together, my life would have been hell. But oh, like, I thought you were gonna say my life would have been perfectly balanced. Perfect, yeah. No, because like, I feel my like mom they would have been like, clean your room. You'd be like, dad, can you get that for me? Yeah. I guess actually now that I think about it. You could have ran that. You could have finessed them. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I just felt like they would have bumped heads, you know? <laughs> yeah, okay, look, this category right here is filled with moms you just don't want to mess with. Take a look and don't F with mom. So my son has his girlfriend in his room. I've decided to scare the crap out of her. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Come on out, Brittany. Come out, come out, come out. Two days later. Oh. Jeez, my bad. My son doesn't have a girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what? 
She's funny. She's funny. She makes her own videos, but she's funny. It's hilarious. Look, do you even have a son? Okay. <laughs> that is funny. It's pretty funny. <laughs> it's in there. Is something gonna jump at me? No. It's in there. Look. It's in there. Take a look. Mom, look. <laughs> oh. You think I'm a fool? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> she played dumb. She like set him up. You know what I mean? Oh, in the beginning, she really made me think that she What's was scared look? and she yeah. didn't know. She did a good job. I don't know. Like, I don't I don't know. know. Look. <laughs> you think I'm a fool? <laughs> oh, wow, Mom, you finally finished with the puzzle. Uh oh. Look, look Here we go good. again. I hate these moments. <gasps> oh. <laughs> like a little asshole. By the grace of God, it's the most really sturdy good. deer puzzle of all <laughs> deer puzzles. Uh, what the f man? I didn't do it. Man, like she got busted because her footprints were on the mirror. I feel like this is at like the height of like 2014 Miley era. <laughs> yeah, that haircut right there in the front. Damn, we're really—he got Bieber hair. Yeah, he does. You know what I mean, he got Bieber Instagram hair. Instagram came out that week. <laughs> <laughs> Instagram. Bro. This is like their first post on Instagram. You looking good. Oh, you yeah. looking good. I be going live <coughs> on Instagram. Nice. I be all my followers get to see me. Who did this? Outside? They get to see me and stuff like that. Who did this? Outside? Look at her face. Yeah. Dirty bitch. <laughs> go back. Go back. Call him that dirty bitch. You the started. Rip. It simmered. Her first shot was you dirty bitch. I don't ever get when you can dry your own eyebrows on while you would stop right there. Man, like Why are you like, this is this is enough. I've uh, I outlined it, it's fine. Let's get some like get some layers. Get in. some girth in there or something. Man. Single line? Yeah. What? Dirty bitch. What? All this coronavirus <laughs> going on and you put your hands in my face. Get the out of my house. Out of my house. What the is wrong with you, mother? Man, all this coronavirus. <laughs> we'll be right back with more ridiculous man. Yeah. Okay, well, you know what type of person calls for their mom when they're in trouble? A mama's boy or girl a or sissy. somebody like a sissy. Hey, now it went down your house. Who are you calling for? I guess I'm a sissy. I, yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I don't know. My mom's been helping me handle a lot, you know. But yeah. I, it's funny though, because it's like I'm like before she was there, I guess I was on autopilot because I've been I was handling so much on my own, you know. And I, I'm like, how was I doing it before you came here, you know? But um, I guess I guess I'm a sissy. I do. I, I call her for a lot of help. Like anything goes down, will you scream for her? Like. Oh yeah. Yeah. When the bird right. flew in the house, I'm like, mom. Like she, like the mouse. She the bird. Out. She, <laughs> Where the oh, f is the bird? You're f <laughs> I hope she doesn't watch this. But cause the other day I came home and she was watching ridiculousness. Yeah, you tell her turn that off. Okay. <laughs> uh, look, this category is filled with people that it doesn't matter what happens to them. The first person they're calling is mom. Take a look at rescue moms. Oh my God, dude. Why would they leave us in here? Man, I don't Come know on. why you're freaking out. Oh it's really nice in Dude, here. calm down. You know, dog have no sense of Man. time. He's like, they'll be gone for like two minutes. Calm down. <laughs> yeah, They've been in there for a day. Yeah, like, <laughs> look, he's in his happy place, man. Mom, I'm stuck in the dog cage. Uh, me too, Mom. <laughs> uh, I get I'm. Mom! What? Like? You're going to be on camera, though. She's like, oh, never mind. I can't help you. <laughs> <laughs> Uh-oh, uh-oh. Hey, what up? Oh, damn. Where is it? What just got on him? Did we see? Oh. Uh, hey! Mom! 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 Oh, he's, he's destroying the house. And it wasn't, it was like, just like a, like a black string. Yeah, it was a fluff. <laughs> it was a fluff. Oh, oh, man. Mom! Mom! Mom. Oh, your mom's gonna have to massage that now. Oh, oh my oh. God. And the way he grabbed this, shrugged uh, it, and shaked it at oh, his son. Man. Your mom's gonna have to massage that now. <laughs> we'll be right back for more ridiculousness. Welcome back to Ridiculousness. Give it up for our guest, Black China. Okay, you have two children. What uh, is the most rewarding uh, part about being a mother? 
man, just like teaching them. I think like teaching them and, you know, doing things like at my own pace, you know? And just like watching them grow, it's like the best thing. Because how old is your son now? King's eight and Dream's four. Okay, yeah, oh man. Yeah, because even like four is where it turns into like a whole different world, right? Where <laughs> like sure. they can talk back, they got their own like way of thinking. It becomes like a whole an entirely different management system, you know sure. what I mean? Uh, would your children consider you a super mom? Yes, absolutely. Okay, look, mm -hmm. this category is dedicated to that same mentality. Super mamas! I'm sorry, what's this about? Oh, yeah. What's this about? Yeah, he wasn't raised right. He online bullying people, cyber bullying. So I'm gonna need you to come on down here. We here now, we gonna solve this. Let's go. <laughs> Mama don't wanna hear it. Let's go. You wanna talk that shit? We're here now. Yeah. Okay. On, on the ring. We're raised right. Listen, my son don't even have no computer. <laughs> we got a cell phone. Do we got a cell phone? Yeah, he do. And he online bullying people. Come on down here. We here. He gonna catch these hands. Let's go. We here. He coming, bitch. I love he gotta fight her. <laughs> She's oh gonna fight gosh. the kid. I love oh, he no. gotta fight her, though. Oh, man. Mm -mm. If a go sleep, mommy give you money. <laughs> How much? <laughs> wait, 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 go back. Connor. This might be me as a baby. Is this footage of me as a child? <laughs> if a go sleep, mommy, give me money. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> hey, look, this is my life exactly. Let's cut a deal. But it's, it's cookies and chocolate. <laughs> yeah. Okay, what did you say? What did you say? This is your hair. I've been saving it as DNA just in case if something got the baby. Okay. And I have this so they can track you. <laughs> Yep, that's Whoa. right. We got your DNA just in case somebody gets you. There you have it for Super Mamas. Okay, is it okay um, to abuse your mother? No. No. <laughs> what? No. No, it's not. No, it's not. never. What about uh, do things that are mean on purpose, but you shouldn't do it, but maybe your mom deserves it? Mm, not if she deserves it. Yeah. You do stuff mean when she doesn't deserve it to let her know it's a joke. Okay. If she does when she deserves it, it's kind of not a joke. That's yeah. true. You're, just You're an abusive your child. <laughs> Look, I didn't want to go down this route, but you took me there. A category <laughs> dedicated there? to abusing mothers. This is your guys' words, not mine. Okay. Take a look at mama abuse. <laughs> Uh-oh. You can get stabbed. You will get stabbed. <laughs> Stop doing that, Austin! You think I'm kidding? Stop doing it, because I'll beat your look, ass look, and look. Look. in the face. Stop, bro. Stop. <laughs> he knows he's just young him. He's like, kidding? just stop. Stop doing it. Bro, come on, man. Oh, Frog? So yeah, why well, she holds so tight? Get that frog! <laughs> Man. Have you lost your mind? Man, he really doesn't like frogs. They didn't find it either. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, 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 she's down. Oh, you're way too drunk. She's down. Okay, go back. There's dogs, there's baby. Like, what? <laughs> Is this baby just setting mama up? I'm right here. Yeah, she's more than hurt. Her spirit's broken. <laughs> All right, that's it for our episode today. If, if, if someone's mom calls you sweetie, <laughs> where do you think that person's mother's from? The South. Always. Or Midwest. Or, or Midwest. Midwest, yeah. Oh, come on, Midwest? Move from the South, yeah. You know sweetie in the Midwest? Well, I mean, if you're gonna put on that weird sweetie. accent, I guess I gotta side with you. Sweetie! <laughs> Is that Chicago? Sweetie! That's some Chicago people. Uh, well, look, there ain't nothing quite like a southern mama. Take a look at southern mothering. You don't leave my yard in a mess. You don't throw your banana peels and your yogurt packets in my yard. Uh -uh. She's right, though. And All pick right. that baby up on the way back. <laughs> yeah, that one. Yeah, <laughs> she has more babies. That baby? That ain't my baby. <laughs> Y'all. Y'all. When I was 16, if I was standing around in a clothing store going, <clears throat> And my mama saw me, she would call the doctor and say, this child is having fits. I think she's possessed. <laughs>
You also didn't have a cell phone when you were 16. I think she loves the devil. Hey! My two boys decided not to join me today. That ain't Big Karen. This is Big Karen. Right <laughs> Man. <laughs> you can't be carrying it when Big Karen comes in the room. Man. They come home and they sleep all day in my house, in their beds, and I get to have the aftermath to deal with. Okay. Today, we're gonna take that option of a place to sleep away. What? Were her children in there? <laughs> no. Now, where are you this gonna is sleep? All that's left of your beds. I'm sorry, but they exploded. Well, nowhere for you to sleep. We'll be right back with more Ridiculous Mess. Here's the thing about being a mom. You got to be able to do everything that you want to do and manage a child, okay? It's difficult. When you have a child, should you leave that child at home and hit the club? I mean, you gotta, no. you gotta find balance, first of okay. all. So you, okay. yeah, you, can, you can't just be leaving your kid at home okay. and hit now, the club. With that being said, can you, is it okay to take that child with you to the club? 100%. Well, my, yes, okay. My dad was a DJ, so I spent actually a lot of time in clubs as a kid. This makes so much sense. <laughs> well, look, being a mom requires a lot, okay? And all these moms are kind of pushing the level right here. They're doing a little bit too much with their kids. We call it multi and Take a look. multi <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get a little bit hot. Oh, oh, that's real. You ain't going nowhere. Every time I see somebody with the kid with a leash, it's like a little monkey leash. So like, maybe that's where this came from, the maybe. idea of it. <laughs> Does she monkey. have on nipple covers is my question. <laughs> And she's like, don't expose me out here. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. I'm not on the drug, so it's fine. I'm not mad at that, though. No? That's fine. Now, nah, don't take the baby over here by the crackhead over here. <laughs> What's up? You want to be a dad? <laughs> I love my cat, but I love my baby just as equal. Hey, she's been pushing swings too much. Her back's staying like that now. Like... <laughs> I've been pushing swings for 10 years straight. There you are, Mr. Peppers. And Julie, is it not so fun to swing with Mr. Peppers? <laughs> Mr. Peppers. Yeah, I support this. Let's just put the baby right next to the speaker. Let's blow his head off. <laughs> but, like, you're ruthless to use your child but, as a booster? First of all, we assume that's her child. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she said, hey, you mind if I use that? Look, when you're a mom, you get to enjoy yourself. Sometimes you gotta do weird stuff. We'll be right back with more Ridiculous Man. Okay, look, you're in the club. Things are wild, okay? <laughs> you see someone that's clearly a mother. How does it make you feel? How do you know they're a mother? They have the baby in the club? Uh, <laughs> Is the baby in the club? <laughs> Could be baby in the club. Okay. Could be sort of age, vibe, right? Okay. Well, it okay. depends. If it's like somebody I know is wealthy and probably has nannies, I'm not as concerned. Oh. If they don't have okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, if they don't have nannies, then I'm concerned for who's taking care of the child. That's a very good point. I, I didn't that even. That's the most like... LA answer I've ever heard. In my life. <laughs> and you want to know the problem is, is like it resonated yeah. with me. You know? <laughs> like, I, like instead of being like, damn, that's so like Hollywood, I was like, oh damn, that's true. That's true. <laughs> Well, look, the every nannies. single one of these moms, I guarantee they don't got a nanny, and their kid is wandering off in the street somewhere <laughs> in a category we call Moms Gone Wild. Take a look. <laughs> give it to me. I'll give her the beer. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, she might be trickling into Grandma Gone Wild. <laughs> So much passion for there only be three people there. <laughs> oh, hail Satan! Uh oh, oh boy. Oh, get it, girl. Yeah. All right, don't ride her like a horse now. She's got to get back to her kids. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with that. I mean, okay. yeah, how old should become a mom? Oh. And then he hits her with the peekaboo on both sides. Oh, man. Over here. Nope, now I'm here. Oh, now I'm here. Oh, man. Ooh. Oh. Oh, boy. Oh, I didn't get that. Oh, man. I 
I've never that seen that and Loki want to try <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. This is like Midwest innovation here, you know what I mean? Midwest innovation at its finest. I saw it on the internet. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, come on, Margaret. She is feeling it. Okay, Margaret, you gotta get back to your kids. We'll be right back with more Ridiculous Man. I'd like to talk a little bit about the great uh, Mildred Hackenberg. Who? Uh, R.I.P. Uh, my sweet grandmother. Oh. Okay, now let's never forget when she dressed up like a skater when she was 82 years old <laughs> and propped herself up on a ledge and shot a photo and then sent it to me. <laughs> and it said, you wonder where you got your skills from and it's, Mildred, you know, <laughs> and she was an amazing, amazing grandmother. You know, do you, do you guys have uh, any stories of amazing grandmothers? My grandma, she's pretty crazy. I heard the other day that apparently she was like yelling at Alexa, play Chanel West Coast, <laughs> <laughs> and was turning up in her little chair that I got her that like spins and stuff. So okay, cool. Sterling, <laughs> no, um, you don't... my grandma right now. We really talk to her that much because she be lying on me. And <laughs> she always spread rumors about me, so I just, whenever I see her, I give her fake information just so I can watch it travel. Yeah. And be like, see, that <laughs> never happened, Grandma. You a liar. <laughs> <laughs> okay, look. This next category is filled with grandmothers that are just special. We call it Great Grandmas. Take a look. <laughs> She had a perfect toe. It's going down <laughs> in Grandma's living room. Oh, it's going down. Oh, 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 damn. oh, oh. the whole squad. Oh, my God, oh, that's squad. amazing. I mean, you gotta get the full shot because she like she just throwing white power over there. Oh man, <laughs> man, got too excited, didn't know how to dab it out. It's just... <laughs> Couldn't remember. Oh, oh. <laughs> skills, skills, oh, skills, 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 skills. And you know that's her record. That's her record to the left right there. She wants to beat her own record. Oh, that's true. That's true. It's like she mad. Man, she is legitimately mad. She just made like 40 in a row. <laughs> Damn. Give me another round. Ah. Uh, Yo, this is some dang oh. That's Chanel West Coast when she get on. Yeah, yeah. This, uh, I literally just looked into my future. Chanel, <laughs> 60 years from now. Yo, this is some dang That's so me. Ooh, ooh. This is raw. <laughs> this is 100% you when you get on. She is killing that shit. I'm dancing just like you are. We'll be right back with more Ridiculous. <laughs> Welcome back to Ridiculousness. Give it up for our guests, Jack and Jack. <laughs> so let me ask you, when you guys grew up, was your mother strict or lenient and allowed you to do whatever you wanted to do? Your mom was probably a little more lenient. Oh my god, she yeah, was my pretty, mom, she was pretty chill. She let me get away with everything. Yeah. You ever hear your mom get mad and just go off on you? Oh my god. Oh, yeah. my mom's like, my mom's like hit me too hard before. You know, have, you, have your mom ever done that? She doesn't know her own strength. You know, mom strength, it's real. You yeah. just get the backhand. Exactly. And yeah, like, yeah. And then she's like, exactly. She's so remorseful. <laughs> like she starts crying, and you're like, mom, what are you doing? Why are you crying? <laughs> you smack me. <laughs> no, but uh, nah, hey, yeah. Hey, moms can be powerful, okay? And in this next category, they're just outright mean. We call them mother goons. Take a look. Bro, she, look, this lady wild, no. bro. She just... She uh, hates. Bro, my weed, bro. He's so high, as he said. <laughs> She's so weed, wild. Man. Look, this lady wild, bro. <laughs> He's like as upset as you can be bro. when you're high, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Oh, my, bro, weed. my weed, bro. <laughs> Get your ass off that pole and go put up your clothes. 
You gotta do your chores before you haul. Open up your clothes, Shakara. Why is she ain't got no earrings on the other side of her hair? It's a fashion statement. Why did you let her have a pole, though? <laughs> This is what you like to do. You want to show your friends that you are class clown, but you get your ass beat at the house because I don't play today. So why? Oh my God! I said in front of all the homies and everything. <laughs> really, the greatest lesson is that three-year-old in her arm is like, I'll tell you what, I ain't never gonna do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna be walking around in school. I can tell you that right now. <laughs> Sick and tired of you yelling at me, and I really don't care. So do something, bitch. Oh. 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 oh hey. It ain't murder if it's your mama. Look, I'm sorry, but... I'm sorry, my ass. You chilling like that? I'm sorry, my TV broke and you chilling. Your daughter. Uh, pictures of shoes. All y'all line yard seller. All line yard seller shoes. My TV shoes? Replaced. Pause it. He's meek right now, okay? He's got his head and his shoulder. He's feeling a little bit intimidated, but he's about to puff up and make his move. Go. <laughs> You always made a situation not that. How the hell am I supposed to work? Uh, you okay, okay, no, he's not about to do anything. All right, that is it for our show today. Thank you to Jack and Jack. Tell me an inspiring story about what makes your mom so great. Oh, this is man. I'm saying, like, you put us on the spot. Like, you got to tell the best story now ever. But your mom going to be like, you ain't shit, son. <laughs> well, just get close. I mean, she's just an amazing woman. Okay, look. I no, she really, no, she really is. Like, she was the mother for a lot of my whole block and community where there was lack of parenting. <laughs> um, and she's just always been an amazing mama, you know? Were you an easy child? Was I easy? Oh, hell no. Yeah. I was the worst child. I used to get suspended all the time. I talked back, cursed the teachers. <laughs> and she was still always there for me, though. <laughs> <laughs> OK. What about you, Chanel? My mom really was like always very inspiring to me because she was like a daredevil. My mom went skydiving a bunch of times, bungee jumping. I always like saw her doing like this crazy, like very like tomboy stuff. So my mom always inspired me to like be a tough girl. God bless. <laughs> All right, well, this next category is dedicated to the difficulties of being a mother. It's called Mom and Ain't Easy. Take a look. <laughs> I love all the new toys. Let's have some fun. What's the worst that could happen? Why does he still have a pacifier? He's like seven. Man, he's a seven-year-old with a pacifier and a mom with no front teeth. Mom, put your seatbelt on. No. Up, up, go back, go back. This is, this is a lesson to all the mothers out there to always be safe. Mom, put your seatbelt on. Put your seatbelt on, Mom. No? All right, then. Oh. I'm gonna I told you to put <laughs> Yeah, yeah. He's trying to save her life. He did. He, he might have saved her life because he's a <laughs> driver. Oh. Oh, I mean, that was not <laughs> funny at all. Like, there was a part of me that I thought that this was, in fact, an accident. But if you go all the way back, she's got, like, a full setup here. Oh, man. And then she, like, smirks at the end. Look at the evil smirk at the end, though. <laughs> Yeah. Quick. Mom, quick. Come on down, Ma. Quick. The old cellophane door. <laughs> Just trying to keep your face fresh, Mom. <laughs> All right, boys. Uh-oh. This old classic behavior. Oh, she has her shower cap yeah. on. She's here for charity, but not to get her hair wet. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Oh. oh! Okay, that's terrible. All right, we'll be right back with more Ridiculousness. Welcome back to Ridiculousness. Give it up for our guest, Big Ed. Okay, let's talk about your mother, Norma. <laughs> oh, Mom. Uh, she's amazing. You know she what is. I mean? You guys got a great relationship. Now, you guys, uh, you guys still living together? Um, sorta. Okay. <laughs> So yeah. we're like, she had got her own place. She needed independence. You needed independence. Who decided to 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 part ways together? Um, well, my mom has thirteen grandkids, nine great grandkids, 
two daughters and a son in Arkansas. So she's looking to spend her retirement there. Oh, and I think man. she's kind of had enough of my ponytail. I'm kidding. Oh, yeah. man. Does she get recognized all the time down San Diego? Oh my God, people love my mom. She's the sweetest. And yeah, yeah. My mom's great, just the best. Yeah, look, I, I, I know it and, and I love my mother. Yes. But she's never shaved my back. You know? <laughs> <laughs> you know she she hits you with the mayo, yeah. man. She cut she's trimmed down the back. She really yeah. she really committed and, and she even ponied you up. You know she did I mean? my first day, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Very, yeah. very sweet, but just like you and I, everybody in this category is mama boys. Take a look. I'm here to give you your good night kiss. Um, um, I'm what? in college and I'm 23 now. I'm here to give you your good night kiss. Uh oh. She probably broke into his house. <laughs> oh, get there. There we go. There we go. Is that his mom? <laughs> That's our manager. Yeah. Yeah. You gotta treat him young. Yeah, yeah. Dude, I'm not gonna lie. When, at Do one you point, have a I was like, dang. I need a kid. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, I need a little personal photographer. Yeah. <laughs> I'm passing the phone to someone who never wants to sleep in his own room and always wants to sleep with me. I'm, I'm passing the phone to someone who vapes a lot. Let's go payback. You're trying to tell me that he is so cute. hit her with I'm a vape a lot. I'm to someone who vapes a lot. Yeah, there you go. There you have it for mama boy. Oh my God. Man, it's been a while, man. It's been a while. You know, it's like, um, I wasn't sure if you guys would have your hand gestures right. You know what I mean? <laughs> Obviously, you just went to some go-tos, you know? It's funny, like, we may not shoot this show for a while, and then we're, like, back here, and it's just like, we're just flowing again, okay? Is this true? Um, do either of you have a nana? A nana? A nana? Yeah. My, I got my grandma still. She's, she, you know, she's probably watching from the nursing home right now. Okay. Yeah, my grandma, uh... I mean, I don't call her Nana, though. Yeah, does anybody? No, I don't think anybody, I don't, don't want to say it, but I don't think anybody black says Nana. Yeah, I've, I, been, I've never called my grandma Nana. Yeah. I've never known a Nana. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, but if you saw one, though, you would probably know. I feel like a Nana has a distinct uh, smell. And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, I, I swear I can uh, smell the smell yeah. as yeah. you said that. Yeah. It's yeah. like it that exact little old yeah. lady smell. Yeah. Yeah. The Nana man. can't smell it. Hey, <laughs> as soon as you said it, I a whack and Like, I'm like, it. oh, there's a Nana like four blocks from here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, well, look, here's the thing about, about Nanas, man. They're fragile. Yeah. You know what I mean? You got to be are. careful around them, you know? And, and, and some people just don't understand it, and they're always out to hurt them, just like everybody in this category. Sorry, Nana. Man. Oh, Ooh. Yeah. oh, oh man. no. Oh. Nana is dressed like she on a hockey team. Man. <laughs> oh! Ah. Oh, you could have killed Nana with your Man. feet. I'm sick of you, you little Man. Because <laughs> you're still at an age yet that you don't realize you can kill Nana. No, that's it. You don't understand that you almost gave her a heart attack and that was it. <laughs> Why is she dressed like she in D2 the Mighty Ducks? <laughs> <laughs> she literally is. <laughs> All right. This seems safe. Oh! oh, oh. Man. He didn't even care. He did nothing. He, he doesn't understand. He don't appreciate Nana. I don't even think he appreciates hitting the ball. <laughs> I'm coming. I, I'm coming. Go! Ah! This son of a bitch bastard. You made me curse. All my good prayers went down the drain. <laughs> <laughs> All your prayers went down the drain that quick? She snapped and then immediately <laughs> felt guilty and like, ah, oh, <laughs> there goes all my prayers. She said all my good I prayers, I thought it was too. your good prayers, yeah. like you got bad prayers. Yeah. <laughs> Rolled it from the plate onto the box. OK. Okay. <laughs> You gotta know you're being set up. Yeah. You know what I mean? You got a funnel in your pants. What, what do you think's about what to happen good here? Come of this? You know what I mean? There's not literally one scenario where a funnel in your pants is going to provide you with something beneficial. Oh, you bitch! You bitch! I'm like, Nana's you're losing it. There you have it for sorry, Nana.
Okay, um, when you hear the word MILF, what does it usually mean? Uh, Mom, I like to F -er. I'm not sure how the two got left out, but... Yeah, it's funny, like, I don't, I never thought about it till right now. I had to go back and check the monitor. I'm like, what, like, where is the two? And then there's like a two in here. I'm like, damn, there is a two for no reason in here. Yeah. It's a matilf. <laughs> it's a miltif, a miltif. <laughs> um, Growing up, people loved to use it when they saw my mom. Your mom's a milf. It was man. like nobody, like no boy from school could see my mom and not say it. But no, you know, a lot of times it's not about effing somebody. It's about friending them. That's true. You know what I mean? A lot of times you see a mother that you would like to be friends with. That's true. I guess my mom still crosses into that move category. She's cool too, so I feel like even if she wasn't hot, she would be that mom. And that's what this category is all about. You know, it's not necessarily about effing, it's about <laughs> friending somebody. Take a look at MILF, mother I'd like to friend. The best thing about isolation is spending time with the kids. Yep. Mom! <laughs> I'm doing what? TikTok. Go oh, off, I'm doing TikTok and shooting vodka. She pouring up. Man, there's no mixer. No. You're drinking vodka like water. Smearing all straight. Here we go. Ready? Dear baby show. Dog. Strong. dog is strong. We're both Cheers. drunk. She's already blacked out. <laughs> Whose baby is this? <laughs> what have you been doing on, on, on quarantine? Um. Well, I get drunk, and I read Harry Potter books backwards to get hidden messages from the devil. Oh, oh, OK. There okay. we go. Your mom's a witch. OK? She lit. Hey, hey. She got lit. a gun. Squirt, squirt, squirt. She thinks she's so young, for sure. Man, I'll tell you what. Barbara hair she is, is risky. <laughs> OK. There you have it for mom I'd like to friend. OK, uh, how much does it hurt to disappoint your mom? A lot, you know? You don't want to disappoint yeah. your mom. You'd rather make her sad or mad than disappoint. Yeah. Disappoint is another level. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, but look, I feel like I've been disappointing her basically all the way through, you know what I mean? Yeah. You know, she, every decision I made, she would have preferred I made a different one. At least you're consistent. Yeah, no, yeah. You know, I tried to explain it to her the other day. Like, you know, it really led to this very high-quality life. Well, <laughs> you could say that. <laughs> but you don't know what it would have been like if you just never moved from Ohio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess that's right. I guess that's fair. You know what I mean? Uh, but yeah, I basically made a lifestyle out of disappointing my mother. You know what I mean? And, and it doesn't stop. It doesn't stop. You know what I mean? Well, look, this category right here is just filled with people that are disappointing mom. Take a look. Uh-oh. Oh, don't. I don't know what. I don't know how your mouth does that. Oh. OK. Yeah, um, please. She's more disappointed that she made another her. Yeah, oh, She's no. like, I, you are. Oh, uh, man, you know, yeah, like, as a parent, you want to make a better version of you. Yeah. You know what I mean? And she's and like, nope, I'm just doing it again. Here it is. <laughs> oh, boy. OK. Give me everything, Santa. Give me everything oh. you're good. Oh, oh. Merry Christmas. Man, look. She has the vibe like I'm done with children. Yeah. yeah. And you want to know who won't do this, Jeffrey? A cat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, you're a bad parent if you're being disappointed right now. Yeah. No more lessons. It's just not working out, yeah. is it? No more lessons. Let's just, let's end the violin phase. Yeah. You really did not do that. Have a real job. Are you sure, though? Oh, Connor! This is so funny. It's not, it's not coming off. A seashell? A, a seashell? seashell? By the seashore? Mom, we can all agree with that one. That was a weird choice. <laughs> oh, yummy. Yeah. Don't. OK. Yeah. Don't post it, Don't you Don't post, post it. I swear to God, it's gonna end up on Ridiculous and everybody's gonna think my son's addicted to sugar cane. There you have it for disappointing mom.